Dear friends, today I will prove that Patricia Cron was wrong in her words about Mecca, Quran and Islam as a whole. You should know her falsehood about Mecca's geographical position. With a view to making the Ptolemy's map incorrect, she falsely claimed that Mecca was to the southwest of Medina, but Mecca's actual position is to the southeast of Medina by at least 15 degree east longitude that equals to 60 miles and it makes Mecca's position as same as Makoraba's position in Ptolemy's map. She misguided her readers by saying that fig, grapes and olive grew on the soil of the place where the Quran was revealed as those are mentioned in the Quran and that the Quraysh are mentioned in the Quran as farmers which is totally false. Thus, she gave birth to the anti mecca thesis of Petra theory. The modern Christian apologetics follow her to fight against Islam. But she was wrong. So, what this modern apologetics say about Islam is also wrong. She misread the Quran to find the opponents of Muhammad sallam, that is the Quraysh, as olive growers which is nowhere in the Quran. She argued that the Quraysh was mentioned in the Quran as farmers, but actually it is not true. Quran mentions the Quraysh as the traders. Both Olive and opponents of Muhammad sallam, were mentioned in the Quran, but Quran never suggested that Muhammad's opponents were Olive growers or that Olive grew in Mecca. She was totally mistaken and the missile of her mistake hurt the western brains uncurably. And their idea of Islam went mad beyond imagination. This short-haired woman termed Islam as Hagarism, although Hagar left no ism for us. And Islam is not an ism. She threw her false missile of misunderstanding on Islam but destroyed the heads of the West. Many inexperienced brains took up her message in a wrong way and started howling against Islam. She had all kinds of qualities of a last woman as described by our Prophet Short hair like the hanging hump of a camel, polyx some free style and clothed in shawl dresses. First falsehood on Islam is the title of her first book, Hagarism, 1987. Actually, there is nothing like Hagarism in Islam and is nothing like that in the world of any age. Her book stands on nothing but falsehood. Her second falsehood is the challenge against Mecca. She said that Mecca was not an ancient city. She declared that no map of the world shows the 7th century Mecca. She could not show any map cartographed around the 7th century, but she claimed to miss Mecca on a 7th century map, a clear proof of her falsehood. Patricia Cron was mistaken to think that the Quran was addressed to the Quraysh, and that everything mentioned in the Quran was seen and experienced by the Prophet Hazrat Muhammad Henceforth, she claimed that all the fruits mentioned in the Quran were grown by the Quraysh in the soil of Mecca. She then declared that Mecca was there for somewhere else than what is now called Mecca. She said that the Quraysh are shown in the Quran as agriculturists. It is totally false. Nowhere in the Quran and Hadith it is said that they were agriculturists or farmers. Quraysh are shown as the servants of the Kaaba and the traders in the Quran. The Surah Al Quraysh reads Bismillah Rahman Rahim, Leila fi Quraishin, for the protection of the Quraysh. Eila fi him Rihlata Shita was Saib, their protection during their trading caravans in the winter and in the summer. Faliya Budurabba Hazal Bayit. So let them serve the Lord of this house. Allah zi at amahum min zuwe wa amanahum min kaub. 
profits them against hunger and gives them security against fear so it is clear by the surah al quraish that patricia crone is wrong about both quran and the quraish and this she did willingly so it is falsehood on her part and the petra theorists stand on this falsehood they do not have any base no truth is there in their theory in their assumption in their anticipation mecca is mecca and it was always there kaaba was there from the beginning in mecca the first proof of the kaaba in mecca is the zamzam you shall find no such well in the whole world as that is in mecca can you disprove it no you cannot you are liars who are running after the theory that petra was the beginning of islam you are liars liars like petrisha crone dan gibson j smith mel and many other like those they are trying to destroy islam by falsifying everything of islam how foolish these people are 